Well, hello everyone. I'm so pleased it's my turn to do assembly this week. We are thinking about you all so much and we can't wait until we get to see you all again. Shall we start in our normal way? The Lord be with you and also with you. Now, I wonder if you can remember the story that Eleanor told us last week, which came from what Christians call the New Testament in the Gospel of... Can anyone remember which Gospel we're looking at? In the Gospel of Mark. And Eleanor told us a story about Jesus doing something really amazing. Jesus healed the paralysed man, didn't he? You said to him, get up and walk. And he did. Now our story today tells us about Jesus doing something amazing as well. But just before our story starts, Mark tells us that Jesus was talking to a lot of people. He was talking to the crowds and he was teaching them and telling stories, a bit like we do in assembly. And there were so many people and the crowds got so big, all of the people that wanted to listen to what Jesus had to say, that Jesus took his disciples and got into a boat. So let's hear what happened next. So Jesus and his disciples were in the boat and when it came to night time Jesus said to his disciples let's go to the other side of the sea let's go so they started to sail there but then something happened and I'm gonna need your help to tell this bit of the story because all of a sudden, the winds started to blow. Now we're going to be wind, but we need to be big, loud, scary wind. So when the winds started to blow, and the waves started to roar, waves. We can use our hands, can't we, to be waves. So the waves were crashing and the water was coming up into the boat. And the winds were blowing. And the disciples were terrified. They were so scared because the water was coming and the wind was blowing and they were so scared. And Jesus, well, Jesus was fast asleep. He was fast asleep in the boat, even though the waves were crashing whoosh, whoosh, and the wind was blowing. Jesus was still fast asleep. And so the disciples went to Jesus and they woke him up and they said, don't you care? Don't you care that we're afraid? We're afraid because 
are you ready to be the waves again? We're afraid because the waves are crashing. Whoosh, whoosh. And we're afraid because the wind is blowing. And then Jesus did something amazing. Jesus. reached out his hand and said to the waves and to the wind, be still. So let's try that. We'll reach out our hand and we'll say, be still. And just like that, the waves, whoosh, 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 The waves calmed and the wind and the wind calmed just like that because Jesus had said be still and the disciples the disciples were amazed Jesus said to them why were you scared why were you scared about the waves and the wind in our boat why were you scared don't you have faith in me don't you believe that I would keep you safe from the waves and the wind. And the disciples, they were amazed and they said to each other, Who is this man? Who is this man? That even the wind and the waves listen to him. He is amazing and then well Eleanor will tell us what happened next now I'm going to say a prayer if you'd like to make it your prayer say amen at the end dear God Thank you for the stories we hear in the Bible. Thank you for the story of Jesus calming the storm. Help us to feel brave even when the waves are crashing and the wind is blowing. and help us to remember that we can trust in you. Amen. Now, Eleanor will do our assembly next week. I can't wait to hear what happens next. I hope you all have a lovely rest of your week. And we are all thinking of you and lots of hellos and wags and woofs from Wilson and Belle too. Bye everyone. Hopefully see you soon. Bye.